Hello, everybody, and welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for being here today. Hope you're all having a great Monday so far. In case you don't know, my name is Ron Megaron, and this is Megaron TV. Today, we're going to be playing a game called Rhyme. If you've never seen this game before, um, you could probably check it out on my YouTube channel. It should be on there as well. Uh, it's a uh, it's a puzzle game, and uh, you, you have a little fox companion. You're going around. You're solving puzzles on this mysterious island. There's not really a whole lot of other... Uh, uh, what do you call it there? Other other contacts. You're just, uh, yeah, you're solving puzzles on an island with a little foxy companion. And it's fun. Very mysterious. There's probably a lot more to it that I'm not really doing justice to the game. It's, it's a beautiful game. <laughs> if that means anything to you. Yeah. Let's just get right on into it. I'm running a little bit behind because, I don't know, it's... Uh, been one of those weeks for me, you know? You know, it's just one of those weeks. I guess we can cut the, uh, really driving dark synth now. By the way, that's, uh, by White Bat Audio, um, which is a very cool little channel there. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. I think I'm good. Okay. But yeah, wait bad wait bad audio. They have a lot of um royalty free royalty free. Holy crap, I cannot talk. I recorded a thing yesterday and I recognized that like a lot of my um what do you call it there? I I recognize that I have a lot of issues with like enunciation and things like that and it's really frustrating. So, I'm going to try to work on that a little bit more. By the way, I should probably put my alerts scene on top of this because I kind of need that. There we go. You know, in case anybody decides to subscribe or to follow or anything like that, it'll pop up on the screen with your name on it. So, yeah. Anyway, here we go. Rhyme. Or as I call it, uh, pseudo Zelda. Kind of, I guess. I don't know. I don't actually call it that. It just seems very similar to Breath of the Wild in some ways, minus the combat. This is a uh, very, as I said, puzzle focused more than anything else. All right, well, we broke all the things. We can also probably make these lights light up a little bit more. No? Okay, you just needed to be a little bit closer to it. I'm just rolling, 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 rolling. Oh, again. Okay. So what, you just can't shout at that one? Okay. Let's see what we got. Let's see what else we have in this mysterious area that we're in. Yeah, the last time we woke up on this island, having washed ashore, um, kind of found our way around it, uh, met up with a giant bird, which uh, was not our biggest fan. And uh, then 
that bird decided that uh, it wanted to kick our butts all across the island. And we sent him away uh, with, uh, we dispatched uh, the bird with uh, with uh, some lightning bolts. We are right back where we started. I feel like this is going to be one of those maze levels. Or it's going to be really difficult to kind of, you know, figure everything out. I'm not even going to bother shouting at all the flames here. I don't think I get anything if I um, shout at all of them. And besides that, I think that I have already missed quite a few. So I'm going to abandon that endeavor. I imagine there are some folks who really, really love this game. Who have gone through and shouted at every single fire and had it work out for them yeah this is a big looping room so we need to figure out how we get out of here and if my luck is any indication it's going to be revealed that you get out by shouting at the flames that I just swore off of shouting at It's an interesting reaction. I've never heard him say, wow. Oh, cool. We're getting a beautiful musical number now. Could you just imagine if I had just left off on the last little bit of this game? Like, if I had just started it back up and it was just literally the last five minutes of the game. And I was left with nothing else to do for the stream. I'm, like, missing something here. Yeah. Have we seen this room yet? I don't think that we have. Yeah, this is definitely, uh, this is definitely giving me some Lost Forest vibes. Oh, maybe I have to shout at this one. Or maybe not. Maybe they won't shout that thing. Oh, but I can dive underwater. I guess when all else fails, just go underwater. By the way, don't take advice from a uh, from a streamer like that. When all else fails, maybe that's not the correct solution for you, you know? But in this situation, it appears as if uh, it might have been. So that's cool. Whoa. All right, stalactites. Show me the way. Whee! I hope there's no monsters down here. I wouldn't know how to handle that. You know, not having any kind of combat or anything. I guess I would have to play sneaky. Hi ho, hi ho, it's up the stairs we go. Do 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 do. Hmm. 
Very interesting. But again, I have no real direction. Oh. Well, I guess we could swim to the surface. As was probably intended. Another dark room. Ooh, what's this over here? Hello. I didn't know I could talk to him. Hello. Howdy, howdy. Okay. Or don't talk back. That's fine. All right, we made it. Nice. All right, I guess time to work our way back down then. Or just drop and break our ankles, you know, like you do. Uh, am I like stuck? I can't tell because it's so dark in here. Nah, I got it. I got it. Here we go. We just had to clear out the greeting party. The welcome wagon, if you will. Oh, look at some statues. Oh, a mural. Wow. What a mural it is. Oh, I guess I'm going back underwater. Back into the great unknown. I guess we'll go this way. It sure is lucky that we have these air bubbles just hanging around. Ooh. Apparently you are fish today. I am fish. I am fish with fox friends. How are you doing today, Sly? Welcome, welcome, welcome. I got a new achievement for Without a Trace. What? 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 I heard a fox. I was trying to look at my achievement. Respect the past. Okay. I apparently respected the past. But welcome to the stream. How's it going? Fox, you sound like you're in trouble. Oh, no. You're just being... You're just being... Your usual... Hey, come over here, self... See, this is just going back to that discussion we had before about you being, like, Navi. Like, hey, listen. I'm awake, that's about it. I hear you, bud. I really, truly do. I was pretty sleepy myself. That's why the stream took a while to get started. But I am awake now and I am here. More pottery to break. Well, we just gotta take advantage of that. Yeah, yeah, I know. I, I saw the uh, the stuff you were doing yesterday that you posted to the group that looked really cool. The um the character sheets. I really want to get some of those um those dot journals. So that I could use them for making stuff as well. Where where are you, Fox? Where are, I don't see you. You gotta make yourself more obvious. 
need to pretty them up. Yeah, but I mean, even for the bare bones that they have, the the dare right now, you know, they still look pretty good. Oh, more pottery. I'm just going to be a menace to this pottery for a second. Apparently I was too far away for that one, though. Yeah. Okay, what is this guy? It's key. Nice. I think. Oh, it's a picture. Interesting. Apparently there were other things that I was not getting previously. Or just haven't gotten until now. Link destroyer of clay pots. Yeah, but did Link ever did Link ever do it by shouting? I don't think so. This guy, he's got that operatic voice. By the way, I've got voice mod turned on, so if you want to go in and like pick a voice mod voice that you want to hear me do, I could do that. Yeah. Link has tongue cut out. Uh, I think that's entirely possible, to be honest. That's why it just always goes, ah! He doesn't even do that. He's like, huh! I haven't played a Zelda game in a long time. Um, I don't know how I'm supposed to get up there. I guess maybe I'm supposed to fill the room with water. Which, if this is another water puzzle level, I'm going to be very sad. Hmm. Knocked and I found out why. He was an absolute creep in the very end. Oh, really? In the old animated show? I guess I could see that. I didn't actually watch the animated show, though, so. I know, woof, woof. I would like to come and see you, but I don't know where how, how to get there. I don't think I can jump up there. Oh. Once again, it's a ledge. Another ledge that I definitely didn't see before. Oh, she was telling you about it. I gotcha. Well, I wouldn't I wouldn't put it past, you know, that that was the case. Maybe all his heroics are to make up for being a creep in the past. Ah. Hello, Fox. Okay, you're running away from me again. I just want to pet you. Okay, hold on, hold on. Stay there. Can, can, can I pet you? I can not. Actually, I just howled. A woo woo woo. Oh, that's adorable. All right, so where's this guy supposed to go then? Over there. Uh, what? That's interesting. Um, Jeez, I hear the bells and stuff, and I just think that it's, like, an alarm that I have set. Because I have an alarm set for me to log off for the day. I don't have to work or anything. I just need to go early. Not even early, just, like, you know. You, you know. All right, I once... Oh, it just opened the door. Great. Well, now we're in here. Fox, how are you always so far ahead of the game? Yeah, I need to adult. Exactly. Need to take care of some business ventures and things. 
Not really. Yes, let's go. Why do you look so scared? I am, uh... I'm a little concerned now, Fox. I'm not gonna lie. A little bit concerned. Alright. Apparently I gotta do this part on my own. Alright, that was a uh, drop off to nothing. Good to know. Good to know. Um, I've also put on an ad manager. It'll play about a minute and a half of ads if you're not subscribed to the channel. Um, and it's coming up in about five minutes. So I'm going to try to keep an eye on that. And when it comes up, I'll pause the game. Oh. What are you? Your sub has ended? Oh, no. Well... That's okay. I'll use that time to like take a break and go get some coffee or something. Put on the beer at back screen so you don't miss anything. But definitely don't download the Twitch ad blocker. Definitely don't do that. Definitely never, ever, ever do that. That was a nice little hint that they gave us there. Oh, that, yeah. Good point. I guess if you're watching on mobile, it probably wouldn't work, but... That is the appropriate responses. Wow. All right, we're going to follow the leader, I guess. Get back here, Sphere Man. Oh, what was that guy's name in Portal? Wesley? Portal 2? You know the one. Yeah, it's a portal guy. Portal sphere guy. But yeah, I put that on so that I could, you know, remind myself to go and like take a break and stuff. Hey, hey you think this thing has ears? Well, I guess it does. Oh, you never played Portal? Well, I know what our next game is going to be. Well, actually, because it's, you know, still spooky season, I want to try to find a spooky game to play. But since so many of them rely on jump scares and I know that you're sensitive to those, it's uh, kind of difficult to really do that. I might do like uh, Plague Tale, but yeah, I do have spooky house endings to find that's true. Oh, no, he's dead. Oh, but yeah, um, color mania and, uh, my brother master stake went through and played the multiplayer on portal two. And it just reminded me that it's a really fun game and I should really go back and play it again. I don't know how well the uh, humor has aged as it came out in 2010, but I don't think that it really had much problematic say anyway. I mean, it's Portal. Ah, that's not good. I guess these ones are a little bit more social than the other ones. Leave me alone, leave me alone. Oh, you know what? It's probably because I did that thing where I went and I exposed them all to the light. 
Yeah, like that. That's probably why they were so mad. Did I shout at them? No. I don't think he had the ability to shout at them, but uh, exploding a ball of light near them seems to do the trick. I'm on a loop ya and I'm gonna boop ya. Yeah, loop them and boop them. Just like in Dead by Daylight. Which I played again recently. Alright. We have an ad break coming up here in about uh, 35 seconds. So, I'm going to let that play and just sit here and sip my coffee for a second. But I'll be back in about a minute and a half. Stay tuned, and I will see you then. It's not even going to go yet. It's like 20 seconds out, so I don't know why I'm doing my thing now. How would you feel if I started doing a TikTok stream? Think about that on the on this minute and a half break. Tell me what you think if I watched TikToks and reacted to them. Showed you my favorites. Okay, be right back. All right, and we are back, I believe. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. We are still here playing Rhyme. I just took a second to drink some coffee, get up, do a quick stretch. I hope you all took the opportunity to do the same. And uh, now we're going to go and explode some people with the power of light. Because that's the way we work around here. Hiss. Hiss. All right, took care of that issue. Okay, we made it up here. Oh. I think my biggest enemy in this game is the dang old... ledges. I haven't met anything that's bamboozled me worse than them dang old ledges. Alright, but we were able to loop them and boop them. Now we're going to come back and we're going to fry them. Uh, or not. I guess I need to run down there and do it there instead. Ah, uh, yeah, see, I tried to shout. And he uh, instead was like, oh, no, I'm just going to sit here and go, ah, I'm a scurred. Ah. 
Oh, they don't actually go away. They just... Okay. Well, I guess this is the direction I'm... This is the same place I already came from. What am I doing? What am I doing, guys? Come on. But yeah, to reiterate my question from before the break, how would you guys feel if I did a uh, stream where I showed you all my favorite like TikToks and stuff like that? Would you enjoy that? Would that be worthwhile for you? Do you enjoy TikTok? And if so, what TikToks are your favorites? Oh, I'm supposed to go this way. Bamboozled once again by the ledges. Rawr. Um, I don't have a ball, so I'm going to go over here. Okay, see you later, suckers. Hey, you guys want to see something cool? Watch this. Oh, well, that wasn't as cool as I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to wake up this guy and it was going to go rampaging and moiter a new lot, but I guess that's not going to happen. Ah, well. I guess we'll just take this ball and run with it. Be just like a football player. Try not to fumble. Alright, so I got to climb up there. I think. My ADHD brain does not do TikTok. I already lose too much time on Twitter. That's totally fair. Okay, that didn't do anything. Yeah, I find that all of the TikToks that I'm recommended now are just like, you have ADD. And I just say, yeah, I know. I feel like that's pretty much everybody's, though, is like, you have ADD if you do this. I'm just like, I have ADD because I have a prescription from my doctor. <laughs> but yeah. Jars in the sand. I think I just got one for breaking a bunch of jars. So that's cool. Foxy, where are you? Whoa. Whoa. Are we going to run laps around the pool? We could do that. No. Can I dive down deep into this pool? See what's down in. Looks like there is uh, nothing really in here. Just crystals. Or diamonds. One or the other. Alright, Foxy, there you are. Woof, woof, woof. That has a rounded edge, which means I cannot grab it. Alright, let's go on and... Okay, let's just do a fast fault. Don't even worry about the killers. It's really funny is that I don't actually have ADD, but because I have... Because so many anxiety symptoms overlap with it, sometimes it feels... You probably... I mean, you, you may. It's entirely possible, because... You know, like you said, there's a lot of overlap there. And I feel like it... And don't quote me on this, but it might be a thing that when you have, like, one... Um... Um... How to phrase it? Like, mental... Uh, condition... One condition of the mind, then you also are likely to have, like, more than one... But again, don't quote me on that. I I took one psychology course in in college and I got a D, so. Yes, there was a time when Ron Megaron decided he wanted to go and get his degree in psychology because he thought that would be really cool to work with like abnormal psychology. Study the minds of like serial killers and stuff like that. But uh 
Yeah, that did not uh, really pan out very well. Okay, this is different than where I was just now. But yeah, I love um, I love studying psychology and stuff. I have anxiety, two anxiety disorders, and multiple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I um, I mean, I feel like I said it before, but like I have ADD. I also have some kind of anxiety that's undiagnosed. I have depression. Um, yeah, I think that it's um, I think it's very much a thing that when you you know, when you have one, you it's entirely possible that you have, you know, multiple. Nay, it's common that that would happen. Oh, look at these guys. They're all like, we're just hanging out. This is just like that scene from what we do in the shadows. Which if you haven't seen what, what we do in the shadows, you should watch it. It's really good. Ooh, it's a tree. Um, I don't know that I should go that way just yet. I feel like there are secrets yet explored in this room still. Um, but as I was saying earlier, um, I also recognized recently that I have issues with like enunciation, and I don't know if that's another like thing with my mind or if it's just that I'm like lazy or what the situation is but like I tried reading off a thing that I wrote for the for uh, for monster of the week and there were so many times where I would just like slur my speech and stuff and yeah wow I guess this is the way to go We breaking my ankles. Oh, never mind. I'm I'm back here. Can I try diving from a lower part? We breaking my ankles. No, no, I cannot. Okay, well then I guess down this way we go. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Midna says hi. Hello, Midna. Hope you are doing well today. Do not cause too much trouble. Yeah, my cat likes to uh, try to eat my phone. I uh, I have new scratches on my phone screen, which... I should not have there because uh, I have a protector on it that prevents it from hitting the ground. And uh, I'm about 99% sure it's because my cat decided he wanted to like just bite down with his, you know, really sharp little teefers, you know, and, and uh, really mess up my phone because I was paying more attention to it than I was to him. Hello, funky tree. What kind of secrets do you have for me? She was a menace over the weekend. Was she doing things that like interrupted your crocheting and stuff? I don't know what that is, but it sounds really cool because of that sound track there, that little flourish. What are you? I guess I'll just yank you out of the, yeah, that's a great idea. Awesome. Are we going to... Did we just kill that tree? Oh my gosh. She interrupted your gaming? I mean the nerve. Of some kitties. Okay, friend. Well, I'm sorry that I ripped you out of your tree. I sure hope that won't have any kind of consequences later on. Oh, I mean the nerve of some kitties. Oh, that's right. We have this thing over here. We got to put the thing on too. 
Hey, look at that. We open the door. We get on the floor. And now everybody do the dinosaur. It was just us. No parents. So she was a little whine. Ah. So you were the only one there that could give her any kind of attention. So she was like, hey. Give me all of your attention. I got it. All right. It looks like we got to go find a piggy. Let's go find a piggy. Let's go find a piggy. I don't think there's a piggy in this room. Oh, so the puzzle is I'm going to have to like. Uh, I think I understand now. Sort of. Not really. Well, actually. No, I'm going to bring this with me. I might need it in another room. Well, that's cool that you got to spend some time like just on your own with your cats. Just relaxing. What games did you play? Ha! Ah. Hmm. Oh, that's right. You did tell me that you were doing Jurassic World or Lego Jurassic. Well, I read it as just Lego, but I, I, I understand now what you were, what you were saying. And Wind Waker, were you doing like the, the star voices for them? All right. Guess what? Down you go. Enjoy. Thank you. Thank you for your service. You didn't do nothing for me. You didn't do nothing. Can I make this jump? No, I cannot. Did the dinosaurs join in a chorus of everything is awesome? Everything is cool when you're part of the team. Yeah, everything is awesome. I don't think I can make that jump. No way, no way. Spent too much time sailing. Is there really an, is such a thing as too much time sailing? I don't know if there is. That is unfortunate. I kind of wish that that was a thing. There has to be a way for me to get over there. There's gotta be. Are there any ladders or ledges that I'm not seeing? I see that there's an entirely other level here. And I feel like they don't put in a lot of useless rooms. Yeah, I know. That's exactly what I was thinking. Is like, are there anything? Is there anything on the wall that I might be missing? But it doesn't appear so. So, we may have to go a different direction, try a different tact. All right. I guess let's try going back down. Wait, I wonder... No. Nah. I thought it would be that simple. It was not. All right, let's go get get our ball, I guess. There has to be a way for us to, like, break through all the other stuff. I was thinking to myself, you know, I'm probably going to finish this game today. And now I feel like that is not necessarily the case. No ledges over there. Just more... Prickly stuff over there. Everything is cool when you're part of the team. Yeah, everything is awesome.
That's another thing, is if you notice anything different about my microphone, I did turn on voice mod. Um, so it might sound like um, either a lot louder or like more clean or I don't know. It might sound different, basically. So let me know if it's uh, if it's better, worse, anything like that. And I'll try to adjust it. Hmm. Cleaner, no feedback? Good. Good, good, good. Yeah, I haven't noticed it being as bassy in this game so far. And I don't know what the cause of that is. It might just be because we're not fighting giant bird monsters. Oh, my friend, you have hidden yourself too well. Too well. Oh, I can't drag you out there. Sad day. Well, what if I did this, though? What if I what if I did this? What if I, what if I did this? All right. Puzzle solved. Just had to crush somebody's head. Like you do. Who says you can't make a, an omelet by cracking a few eggs or something like that? You know what I mean. What should we name our new ball friend? I think we should call him Henry. I don't know why, but the name Henry comes to mind. Or we could call it Lucille. Lucille Ball. Get it? She's from around here. Not in the game, but like... She lived in upstate New York. Um, hmm. Ah, there it is. I was about to say, I need to find some place to put my ball. And then we found it. Wilson, that's a good one, too. Wilson! Oh, got to line up the ball with the circle there, yeah? Okay. All right, all right, all right. I see. I see what you're going for. I'm picking up what you're putting down. I smell what the rock is cooking. Cool. I guess that would be fitting, too, because we just got rid of it, so. I'm sorry, Wilson. I'm sorry. Ah. Okay, um, I guess I'm just going to do my forward roll or just jump straight off, break my ankles. Who cares? Uh, you got to go someplace, buddy. And I feel like you reflect light or something. So... Yeah, bigger ball. This is just Wilson Sr. Wilson is uh, Wilson's dad. He's like, "Where? What did you do with my son? Where's? Uh, what was it? Was it, um from the fugitive? I want my family. Yeah, that's the one. Uh, okay, we got waterfalls." All right, swan dive. Woo! Oh, I died. Well, that's not ideal. Thing there, thing there. Do we have any ledges around? I don't see any ledges. I don't see any really good ways down.
Oh. I mean, that's not even that far of a drop. I don't see why I can't make that, but I guess I just can't. The game won't let me. Um... <laughs> I feel like I need to start doing, like, the Blue's Clues thing where I'm just like, look at the screen, everybody. Tell me, do you know where that box guy is supposed to go? Good job. It is in the other room, but we need to open that door first. All right, well, um... This is technically not going to work because it's a rounded ledge. So. Oh, look, it's an eclipse. I mean, don't look directly into the sun when there's an eclipse going on. We don't want to be like, you know, that that one guy who did that that one time. You know, the one that used to lead the country. All right, let's move you. Oh. Oh, of course. I should have just known. Whoa. What is that? It's an even bigger ball. Oh, no. I showed it too loud, and now it exploded. Why are we? You're alive. Why did I suddenly go Italian? I said this the other day. Every accent that I do turns into a, an Italian accent. It is alive and apparently it likes to be petted. Aww. Wilson Sr. Let's not talk about what happened to Wilson, okay? Let's just not talk about that. You're here now and you're much cooler. And apparently very curious about life. All right, let's go forward. Forward ho. Yeah, isn't everything really interesting? Ah. Come on, I'm right in front of it. Wow, we look at that. Uh, Wilson Senior, please be careful. It seems that that track is powered like in Minecraft. Please don't get hurt. I just made a new friend. I don't want him to die. I'm watching Star's VOD. She has one accent called Clusterfuck where you never know what you'll get. Yeah. I feel like I can relate to that a little bit. All right, we're going to get this guy picked up. Hey, you know what I could do, right? You ever seen this before? Watch this. Watch this. Watch why. What, what, look what I could do. Look what. Look, 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 what, look up. All right. You ready for this? Watch this. Look what I could do. I'm going to drag you around. You weigh nothing to me because you're a, a video game character and therefore don't actually have any weight. Wow, that is not what I was expecting. Uh, okay. Wilson, I didn't know you were a musical. Now you're in a tuning fork? What the heck? That's really cool. I don't know what this ball was for then. I guess we'll have to figure that out. Everything in this game is just revolves around balls. It's kind of funny because when you think about it, you know, balls revolve. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Maybe we'll move this over here. Let's go and open a door that tuning fork. Yeah, it's actually a tuning key.
I know I said tuning fork, but man, the pun was right there, and I just completely missed it. Zoe would be very upset. So what it? Oh, it changed where I am. Fascinating. All right, ball man. Let's see where you. Oh, you go on top of the legs, of course. Very nice. Wilson Sr., you can walk. Although apparently not very well. It's kind of weird that Wilson Sr. was born after Wilson Jr. This is like a real time travel conundrum kind of thing. Cool. It's like uh it's like watching a baby giraffe for the first time. Wow. Oh. Sorry about that. I had to snooze the ad really quick. <laughs> uh we have an ad coming up in about five minutes, but this was happening, so I didn't want to skip it. Wow, you're really big. Yeah. You walk like this. Yeah. Stomp around. I'm not going to lie. This is kind of how I picture Tim in my head. <laughs> like when we're doing what's left of us, this is how I see Tim. The first time you try six inch heels. <laughs> Uh, I legitimately have no idea what that's like, so... But... I'll take your word for it. Don't mind me, I'm just coming through with a ball. Do you follow the ball? Oh, you do, you do follow the ball. Okay, let's go this way. I don't know where it's supposed to go, but... Yeah, we're going to put the ball right there. I'm going to do some experimentations really quick, okay? You stay here. Oh, wait, never mind. So what the fuck? What am I supposed to do with this? Yeah, cool, right? The ball. All right, Wilson Sr., tell you what. You help me with this. And, uh, something will happen, I guess. I don't know. I legitimately have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. But yeah, he does look like Wilson Sr. All right, well... Since it is about time for us to go and take a little break, I'm going to run one more ad, and then we will be back with some more of this beautiful, wonderful game. Um, I'm going to get up and stretch. I encourage you all to do the same, and we'll be back here shortly. Yeah. Be right back.
All right, and we're back. Thank you so much for your patience, guys and gals and non-binary pals. Okay, we are getting back into rhyme. I have uh, taken the opportunity to switch into my standing situation, I guess, because I figure that's probably not bad for me, right? Probably a good thing to stand around as well. So let's get back into this. Oh, I should probably turn off the music first. That'd be a good idea. Okay, here we go. So you can hear the beautiful soundscapes of Rhyme. All right, all right. This kind of just helps me like wake up and also, you know, it just it feels nice to be able to walk around and do stuff. Oh, wait, no, I get it now. I understand. I definitely didn't look up a walk up while I was gone. Walk through. A walk up? What the fuck is a walk up? Do I have the right screen? Okay, I do. Good. I wanted to make sure I had the correct screen up as well. All right, Wilson. Wilson Senior, you come over here. Yeah, come over here. I'm gonna set this here, okay? I'm gonna set this right here. You just you stand right there. Okay, we good. We good. Okay, good, good, good. All right, now then we gotta shout at this guy, huh? And then we're going to push this over here. Don't worry, Wilson Senior. Don't worry. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. I'll be back here shortly. I just need to take care of some stuff first. Do some adulting or something. I don't know. Whatever those millennials are calling it these days. Look at that. We opened the door. Now it's time to get on the floor and everybody do the dinosaur. Yeah, you go stomping through there. Check out what the world has in store for you. Isn't it beautiful, the world? All right, I'm going to try to do a... Nice. Okay, I'm glad to hear... I'm glad, I'm glad, glad to see that the, uh, the heights are kind of arbitrary. In terms of what counts as death and what doesn't. There's nothing over here. Wilson Senior, look at you. You're exploring the world without me. Please stop. I don't want anything to happen to you. You are my most valued friend in this entire world. I would feel terrible if anything were to happen. Yeah, kick the door down. Sorry, I just had to adjust my microphone stand. Come on, kick it down. I know you can do it. You got those big legs. All right, I'll try to find a way in. Hmm, there's brambles over here. There's nothing over here. But there's also a staircase, so let's take a look and see what's up the stairs. Oh, look, there's a little thing we can use to open the door. Look at that, Wilson. Look at that. Should we continue to call him Wilson Senior? Should we call him Daddy Wilson? I feel like there's a lot more, you know, marketing ability there. Especially recently with the, uh, you know, all the things happening in wrestling. Don't stop me! This is not that kind of stream. <laughs> You know, now that I think about this, this seems to be the outset of uh, Half-Life 2. More than anything. Yes! Cause all this wanton destruction. Break everything! What was it they said in Mind Scanners? Break the system? Hey, we're back here. Are you going to like give me a boost so I could get up in that area? That'd be really cool of you. I don't know if I've seen this part before.
Oh, look at that. Good job, Wilson. Good eye. Get it? Because he's only got the one. Look at him go. I know. He's just, he's, he got used to those six inch heels real quick. Wee! Oh my gosh. Gonna take this ball. And just ride this lazy Susan on down to the, down to the ground. What are you all doing here? Leave Wilson alone. Bunch of jerks. All right, let's go. Now I'm just going to need you to sit on this little... Uh, no, okay. I guess I'll go and get the ball of light then. Man, oh man. Ball of light. Superstar. Who are you, etc. But uh right, let's go. Don't mind me, I'm just taking hugging the wall, literally. Yeah. Break all the things. They were awed by his magnificence too, yeah. Probably. They're like, hey, we've seen your type before, but not in a long time. And you saw the ones that were strewn all over the place. Yeah, there you go, Wilson. You understand steps. Go, Wilson, go, go. Well, come on up. Oh, come on up. I don't think you need my help. Oh, you were just waiting for me. That's so nice of you. Oh, I should go up to this one. You know, which is so obviously marked by the dead grass. Hey, uh, kid, could you, uh, could you not do that? Please, could you, like... Oh boy, okay, here we go. We gotta go all the way back down here. This is an inconvenience if ever there was one. Jesus Christ. Little kid. Why can't you just make a simple jump? And the answer is because he is me. And I am him. Or her, I don't actually know. Again, this child seems to be kind of nondescript in terms of gender, so. All right, here we go. Hello! Once again, Wilson, I guess we just have different paths, you and me. It's, uh, it's nice that we're at least in an environment where the yellow grass sticks out. As opposed to before, where I would have to, uh, you know, really, really look for it. We are you kidding? Oh my gosh! It's too bad I can't go find like a hand glider or something. That would have been nice. Oh, okay, doing some stretches. Doing some stretches. We gotta get like a like a running start at this. Okay, here we go. Wow! Oh, okay. Maybe I just can't make that jump. That's the uh, assumption I'm going to operate under. Is that I'm not supposed to jump there. Go back and do it again. No! I refuse. Oh. Interesting. Oh, the door's open. I didn't even need to do that. Jeez. All right. Well, stompy stompy. Looks like we're back in this place now. Oh, thanks for standing on top of that. Where did the thing go? Wilson, you're a little too heavy. You're bringing us underground. Ah! Okay, here we go. That's a lot more graceful. Oh, God. 
I did not recognize that there was a thing there until it was almost too late. <gasps> it's a it's Foxy. It's okay, Foxy. You don't have to be scared. Or maybe you should be. I don't know. I, I don't think Wilson really understands his power quite yet. Although apparently he's going to howl and potentially cause us more problems down the line. We have friends now. This is just like up. We got the big bird. We got the dog. We got the little kid. We're all trying to get to the big thing there in the sky. I don't think that was the whole point of the movie, really, but... I mean, it's kind of the same dynamic, though. That's what we should have called it. We should have called it Kevin. If we had any foresight, we would have known this was going to be just like the movie Up. And we would have called it Kevin instead. That's okay, Wilson. We still love you. Even if your name should have been something else. Oh, great. It's you guys again. Okay, well, hold on a second. I got something for you. Hang on a second. I'm sure I got a gift for you over here somewhere. Where are you, Fox? This way. Ah, I got an itch on the back of my head. Oh, there you are. Yes, I see. It is a uh, beautiful landscape sort of thing. The stuff of desktops, if you will. Why did I just run around in a big circle? Maybe it's just in this room? Oh, it is. It is just in this room. I am the dork here. Sorry, Wilson. Let me clear out this little obstruction here really quick, okay? Here we go. Yeah! Oh, this is the same place from earlier. I should have known. I wonder if they'll stay gone now. I should have known. All right, Wilson, wait up. I know you're having fun with your new legs and everything, but I need a second. Pretty please. Listen, to, I'm just katunking, katunk, 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 katunkin over there. Oh my god, there's more of you? Well, I guess that would make sense. They did respawn. This explains so much now. I don't get it, Wilson. You are literally a big ball of light. Why don't you just use your powers to explode them? Although when you think about it, this is their life energy and we're just kind of using it in a random manner to uh, destroy these creatures. Oh, you guys want something? Watch this. Yeah, that was pretty cool, right? All right, Wilson, let's go. We don't got to deal with these scrubs anymore. Yeah, we. I take small steps. Slow down. Oh, you're... Oh, my gosh. Look, I keep telling you guys, and you just don't listen. We don't want any. Yeah. We don't want none. And you don't either. I'm just going to roll to try to keep up with you, okay, bud? Even if it ends up injuring me in ways that, will, you know, will end up shortening my life. <laughs> katunk, katunk, katunk. All right, we made it through to the other side. Hopefully nothing bad happens on this really rickety bridge. I would really prefer it if we made it across safely with Wilson. And it looks like we will. Yay. Yay, we got a new friend. New friend, new friend. I 
I keep hearing this skittering sound, and I think there's going to be, like, bugs. But I don't see them anywhere. Wilson, look! It's your hole! This one fits you! If you're a fan of Junji Ito, you get that reference. Aww. He's sad because all his other friends are dead. Poor guy. Wilson, get back here. Don't go stomping off into the dark with no guidance or nothing. That could be really bad for everybody. Wilson! I understand that you're sad. But you literally don't have to do this. Look, it's like the prophecy foretold. It's a small child and you... Oh, good job. I should have called you Juggernaut. Wowee. Okay, up the st there's no stairs here. I thought there were steps and there are none. But there are steps over here. That's interesting. So I think he got rid of the steps by standing on that one section. Woof woof, I know. I wonder what we would do if this happened. Wilson, you want the ball? Want the ball? Nice, okay, good, good. Yep, 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 I know. I hear you. Okay. Uh, um, hmm. Uh, there might be. That's a good question. I know that... Oh. Wait, no. Those those steps were already there. Right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Um... Hmm. So we have to find a way... Maybe we have to do this one first. Maybe that's what it is. Because, yeah, I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be... Okay, so he is going to go back to that one no matter what. Maybe we're supposed to do it like this? Bring it over here? Because I think there... I think you're right. I think there's supposed to be a block for that one. Come on over, bud. Come here. Let's see if we can run up the stairs. Okay, stay there. No, no, you're fine. You're fine. Stay there. Okay, we got up here now. See, now, I didn't have to destroy it because he walked away. So that was... That could prove to be a big old dumb on my part. Uh, yep, there's supposed to be a ball on there. Okay. So, I guess let's go over here first. These puzzles, man, they're too complicated for a simple-minded person like me. And of course, there's always the ledges. Always the ledges. You know, the ones that don't have any clear markings on them or nothing. Oh, thank God. I thought he was going to jump down. Now, 
I can't reach that. All right, here we go. We're going up on this platform. This is very dangerous for a small child like yourself, but I guess I did also make it so that you jumped down quite a few times. So Ron has met his match. The ledge. True. The ledge is my ultimate enemy. Especially when it's hidden. Um, That way, I suppose. Oh, good thing I made that. Otherwise, I was have to gonna have to start over. Okay, jump up there, jump up here, and ba ba da ba ba ba, bada bing, bada boom. Coolest guys in the room. And you can't teach that. I should probably get behind this instead. All right, I made a mistake. I'm supposed to pull it this way. Bada bing, bada boom. Coolest guys in the room. We'll just bring this guy over here. And just plop it right on down here. There we go. Yeah. Nice. Oh, come on. This is a moving platform. What kind of balonium is that? Okay. Well. Let's go back and get our ball, I guess. Ron has met his match in multiple ways. There's the uh, there's the ledge. There's the uh, there's the dangle thing that uh, there's this ball here, which uh, distracts my big old friend Wilson. Call him Kevin Wilson from now on. Sounds good to me. OK, and now we're going to move this guy back over to the other section. I see the solution to this puzzle. This guy's going to go back over here, so we don't got to move Kevin. Kevin Wilson. Put him there. Run up on these stairs. Get over to the other side. Yeah, you were right. There was a block. My thought was that the solution would be that I had to drop the block down the middle, but it turns out the solution was, in fact, not that. But yeah. Good thinking, Sly. All right, we opened the door? I don't actually know. It looks like it made a big blue globe. What does it do? I see the future. Wow, all of Kevin's friends are back. All of Wilson's friends are back. Now I can name one of the other ones Kevin instead. Okay, so we got Kevin, we got Wilson, we got Willie, we got, uh... Uh... I don't know, what other names we got for these guys? There's like five of them, seven of them, ten. There's a lot of them. There's quite a few of these guys, actually. Yes, I have an army. Kelly, yes, we got Kelly, we got Wilson, we got Kevin. Oh, God. That, that one there at the back, that's Amanda. This guy, he's Jigsaw. Don't ask why. He's my favorite. Dang. Sounds like stomping here. Uh... Alright, get out of my way. Wilson, you made it all the way back here so quick. What the heck? I thought you were at the front of the line. I didn't realize you were that far in front of the line. Old man Frank, yeah.
The three-handled moss-covered family credenza, of course. You know them, you love them. Alright, I don't know what to do now. Oh, never mind. Apparently I do. Forward, march, etc. Not on top of me, though! Ah! Okay, this musical choice makes me think of Fantasia. <laughs> like the Sorcerer's Apprentice. Alright, you guys go that way. I'll go this way, I guess. Do I have an army of bots behind you? Yeah. That is true. I do, in fact, have an army of bots. Much like every place else on the internet. Hey, come on, buddy. Come on. You still got the you still got all your youth and stuff like that. Don't don't start slowing down on me now. I know you're giving them time to get up the stairs, but they don't need that much time. See me if I tried to run up a spiral staircase like that, I'd have to take a break about halfway through and start like gathering my breath and stuff. I'd move more like these guys. Wait a minute, where's Wilson? I'm seeing all the rest of yous. I guess Wilson's just walking behind him. Yeah, like old man Frank. Look at it. Look at old man Frank. Look at him. You can tell he's old because look at how he walks. But he's still going to fight. Or do something. I don't actually know what these guys, their intentions are. <laughs> Apparently we're swimming. While I'm swimming, they're just walking underwater. They don't have to worry about oxygen like I do. I keep forgetting that I put my water bottle underneath my desk. Hey, look, it's that guy. You know the one. Him. Hey! Hey, what you doing? What you doing here? Hey. hey! I'm calling out to you. Why don't you answer me ever? Oh no, you fell overboard. Oh no, you really fell overboard. Wow. So tragic. Oh, jeez, my knuckles. They're all sore and stuff. Hey, look at that. I must have passed out swimming. But it's okay, because we got, we got Wilson here to carry us along. Wow. Maybe it's your dad. It's entirely possible. <laughs> I have thought about that. Wow. Thanks for the ride. Oh, wow. I just had my voice cracked. That's great. <laughs> Thanks for the ride, Wilson. Appreciate you. Okay. Where to, where to now? Okay. So we do have an ad break coming up. Just so you're aware, it'll be starting in about a minute. 
I hope that you will take this time to stretch. Get yourself any kind of drinks that you may need. Do any kind of stuff, any kind of self-care that you can do in about a minute and a half. And we will be back in about, uh, it's going to start about 40 seconds, so. Like I said, we'll be back in about a minute and a half after that kicks off. But, the one way that you can stave off ads is by subbing to the channel. For the low, low cost of $5 a month, the low to some people anyway. You can, uh, you can subscribe to the channel, it will help me out. And also, you can skip the ad breaks. Although, frankly, the ad breaks are just going to be the beer right back screen anyway, so. <laughs> so, uh, you can subscribe if you would like to support the channel, but you don't that's totally fine we'll be back in a couple minutes in the meantime enjoy these tunes in more than 96 well i mean i can run more ads if you'd like but uh yeah all right here we go we're gonna start the ads now be right back We are back, and I forgot to unmute my microphone, so. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. Thank you for being here. Let us continue now with our regularly scheduled program of Rhyme. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. No, 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 don't start a new song. Don't start a new song. We are getting back into Rhyme, which has its own soundtrack. I appreciate you, White Bat Audio, but... This game has its own soundtrack, so let's get back into listening to it. In all of its beauty and glamour. Alright, here we go. Where we left off, our friend Wilson and his army of enormous eyeball creatures were gallivanting through the ruins of this once beautiful island. No idea what they're here for. But they're here nonetheless. Oh, look, it's a crying monarch of some sort, I assume. Crying person. Foxy! You were just sitting on the statue. What's up with that? Okay, we gotta go and catch up to the fox. Last time on Dragon Ball Z. Which is kind of fitting because we are following a giant ball around the... Uh, around the... Uh, planet here and i guess there are how many dragon balls were there was it five seven ten i don't know scene oh no it's those guys but they don't seem very concerned with me now the last time they were trying to marry to me all right i'm glad to know it was seven i thought that was the case but 
I have been mistaken before. Foxy, what are you doing out there? Get back here. Yeah, I think there's uh, I think there's seven of these guys too. So we really are uh, we're doing the whole Dragon Ball Z thing. This is going to be the last uh, little bit of the stream, by the way. At about 2 o'clock, I'm going to be logging off. So, I hope you enjoy it. Oh no, what are you doing there, Wilson? Wilson, get out of there. Something bad's going to happen to you. Oh no. Poor Wilson. He got cut in half. Thank you, Wilson. At least I assume that was you. You were leading the pack after all. Okay, I can't go down there. This sacrifice will not have been in vain. Etc, etc. Maybe that was Kelly, it's possible. I can't tell them all apart anymore because I think that when they went through the water... Oh wait, no, I think maybe this is Wilson. Yeah, because he's waiting behind for us. Thank you, Wilson. At least that's your name now. If At the very least, it's become a title. Maybe it was old man Frank. He was like, I'm an old man. I've done my part. Now I'm going to do my part one more time. This is giving me a splitting headache. Get it? Because it got split in half. Okay. Glad that was there. Jump up here. Just climbing more ledges. Buttons. Hi, Fox. Hello. You look awfully sad. Wilson, I really appreciate your passion for wanton destruction. I gotta tell you. It's really, it's a, it's a boon to the team. I love that you're just willing to kick down the walls, literally. As we should all do. At some point in our life. Okay, I don't think I could climb there, so I'm going to have to climb over here. Where the ledges are a little bit more legibly marked. What? Excuse me. Was I just seeing things? I'm pretty sure there was somebody peeking their head up over there. All right, well, we're going to keep on keeping on. Wilson just here to cause wants and destruction. Yeah, it's his whole bag. Oh, I see bad guys up there. I don't want to go up there and give them any kind of hugs. Oh, no, another one is going to open the door for us by sacrificing themselves. All right, goodbye, old Greg. Goodbye. Or maybe you're the moss-covered three-handled family credenza. I can't actually remember. They will not have died in vain. That's Marshall. Okay. I'm glad somebody's keeping track of who these who these these guys are. Why is there another one of these doors right after the other one? Ah, uh, come on! Don't do this now. <laughs> All right, Wilson. Well, I guess you're the last in line, so you gotta go through the hole. But I'd prefer that you didn't, because I'm a little kid and I don't understand loss. Oh, that one's legitimately sad.
Now we will cause wanton destruction. It is up to us, Foxy, to cause all the wanton destruction. <laughs> Wilson, I'm sorry. <laughs> Yeah, I had read before that this game was uh, maybe a little, maybe a little sad, and now here we are in the shrine of sadness. I don't know where Foxy went to, but we're gonna go and find uh, find him. Oh, look at them! They're all grieving. They don't want to murder me anymore. Or maybe they just don't recognize me. I don't know. Oh, look, it's a thing. It's a king kissing a, a something on the knee, I guess. I don't actually know. That's what I saw anyway. All right. Uh, maze time. What's that up there? Can I shout at it? Apparently he is too sad to shout. That is understandable. I had a feeling we would have to part with Wilson sooner or later. Okay. Let's go back this way. Where are we running to? Oh, I thought I triggered a cutscene. I just ran into a wall. Okay. Oh, look, it's a thing. Let's go over and get that. It's going to require some expert jumping. Whee! Yep. Bah. Or just some moderate platforming abilities. Man, I gotta tell you, if I just went through that kind of loss where I lost my best friend who was good at wanton destruction, I would probably not be jumping around as much as this guy is. But also, where am I supposed to go now? <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh my god. That is so sad that you fell off like that. Now I gotta go back and do it again. All right, let's get up here. See if we can go the other way. Unless we're supposed to go that way first. I can't actually tell. There was an area, not a platform to jump at the last pillar. So I might have had to go over that way. It might have just been another unlockable. You know what? I haven't gone, done any of the unlockables yet. So if that is the case, I want to go over and get it. Um, I think we're going to have to go back and start over again. Yeah, it looks that way. I mean, if it wasn't true before, it sure is now. Yep. 
Get on up there. Get on up there. Okay. There we go. Yeah, you're right. You are correct. No, 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 no. There we go. The reason I missed it last time is because somebody was in here cutting onions. Look at that. Oh, we must be getting to the end of it then. Since that's the last thing. We didn't get our little Wilson figurine. Dang it. I forgot the figurines were even a thing. Otherwise, I would have tried to get it more. Well, either way, we will never forget Wilson. All of his sacrifices. He used up all of his rage in order to get us to where we are now. Okay, let's go over here. Jump on over there. Um, I don't think we can make that jump, but we can definitely make this jump. Okay, up we go. Could you imagine if we made it this far and then missed that last one? I would have been so upset. Aw, oh, Foxy! Aw. Foxy, don't you leave me too, you son of a bitch. Who's cutting onions? Is it the cat? Did the cat cut the onions? Fucking cats. They're doing it with their little claws, making them all nice and small diced. Blah, 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 blah. That's what you all sound like. Um, is that not a thing then? I mean... Okay. Well, this looks familiar. It's literally the place I just ran through. Is there another door that was going the other way? Because I thought I saw the fox fly off in this direction. Yeah, that is... Uh, you're probably right. No, I definitely remember this section. This game wouldn't have me backtrack, would it? You know, I used to have a little foxy friend who would tell me where to go. All right, let's re-examine this. So I get the feeling we're supposed to go over this way. All right, I don't think there's any chance I'm making that jump. Unless, nope. Hmm. 
Is there a ledge? I was just looking for that too. I don't think there is. Let's just keep running through the labyrinth. That's what this is, a labyrinth. Somebody queue up the David Bowie, please. Okay, we got about 10 minutes to get this done. Let's see. This is definitely where we were before. No ledge. Hmm. I don't know why, but you said David Bowie and I had fan with the opera pop in my head. I know they're not even remotely related. No, I think they're kind of related. I feel like David Bowie was probably friends with Andrew Lloyd Webber. I wouldn't be surprised if he was, you know, partially responsible for cats. Okay, we got to get up there. That's the bottom line. But Stone Cold said so. Okay, move it on over. Rock it on over. Oh, so that stuff, you can grab onto it. Okay, good to know. Wish I had known that before. I don't know how that's going to help me here. Well, maybe I can climb back up on there. Okay, so we've seen multiple of those around the area, though. Alright, no, so that's not an option. Let's go to the next one, I guess. Well, I'm not making that jump, either. You know, we used to have a giant guy who would, you know, just come and move these things for us. Contribute to the cult's totem. Oh my gosh. I haven't played that game in a while. Thank you, Sly. Um... Wow. Well, I guess let's go find the other ones, because that will probably help us somehow. I'm not, like, going crazy, right? Like, there was definitely more than just that one. Wasn't there? Can I move this? No. 
Okay. Good. There is more than one. Come on, shout. Okay, or don't. All right, we must seek out the others then. Try to hang off of those. Here's me. Okay. I thought that jump was going to be a lot more difficult than it was. Have you yelled at the fire? No, actually. That's definitely lighting up the fires. Are we seriously back where we started? Oh, wait. Look, we made it. Yay. Aw, poor fox. All right, where's that one going? Oh, it's just like at the beginning of the game. It's going to the center there. Hold on one second. I got an ad coming up, so I want to snooze it. There we go. Sorry. Okay, so our next one is all the way over there. Let's see if we can get all the way over there. Up we go. There's another one. Come on, kid. I know you can do it. There it is. Okay, good. I was like, it has to be that I could do that. It wouldn't make any sense otherwise. Oh, and there's another one right over there. Good, good. There are several in this area. Even better. Do I want to destroy all these right now? I don't know about that. I feel like I probably have to. Okay. Well, let's get rid of them, I guess. Our thing is up there. See, sus. Yeah, you were right. You you were correct. Those were indeed very suspicious. 
Save first? I don't have a save option. Otherwise, I would have. No, you dummy. You don't want to jump over there. Although, it doesn't look like these open on the other side, so... Yeah, I'm just going to be able to parkour across there, I think. There might be a bit of a height discrepancy that might prevent me from doing it, but I think I should be able to. Nah, that should be fine. This one is going to be the tough one, but if I can make that jump, and I have no reason to think I couldn't. There we go. Yeah, that's good. That's good. This music is so goddamn melancholy. And it's fitting, but like, damn. Make my manly tears well up inside of me. I know, a woo woo. Poor Foxy. A woo woo. <laughs> Alright, so that one over there. Where is the next one? I don't think there is a next one. I think that was all of them. Alright, time to drop down. I'm just going to take a shortcut and break my ankles. I think this was the way. Man, it really does, uh, it, it really is uh, one of those situations where when it rains, it pours, huh? Alright. Looks like maybe we do have a couple more to get. Oh, this one just never went away. Are you? I could. I could have climbed up that this whole time. Well, geez, that would have been nice to know. Yeah, I did notice that, that one's like kind of flickering. Uh, we gotta find a way up there. How do we get up to the top? There has to be a ledge or something here. I really feel like I'm just going to be able to grab it by... Yeah, I literally could have just jumped up there. Well, I'm, an, I'm a dummy. Don't mind me. I just spent 10 minutes trying to find the way up here and... Did not need to. I know, a woo-woo. Is that all of them? All right, one second. I'm about to come up on another ad. I'm going to snooze it again. So we got like another five minutes. Okay, and that looks like it's the last one over there. Maybe I feel like it does things in sets of five. So I'm going to say that one's got to be the last one. Get out of my way. Hmm. Okay, we got to get over there.
Looks like I could jump over from here. Possibly. Or not. Or they were just teasing me. What a bunch of jerks. Alright, we just have to find our way through here. Um, <clears throat> um, oh, yeah, that's right. We got to go over. No. I keep trying to make that jump, <clears throat> and I never can. Yep, that was the last one. Oh, gosh. Just in time, too. My alarm just went off. Okay, now I just gotta scream one more time. There we go. We get the big statue. The crying child. Not having a map sucks. Yeah, really. It's a nice artistic uh, statement, though, about being lost in grief. Because I feel like that's what's happening here. Aw, oh, we leave in Foxy too? Jeez. I knew this game was sad. I didn't think it would be losing all of your friends sad. Jeez. Oh, and now I'm made of stone. Oh. But I broke through it. And now I'm one of those creatures. That's peculiar. I can no longer roll or jump. Or shout. Oh, now I can. I just needed to get my sea legs about me, apparently. Maybe I am the thing that grows up to become the other guy there. Yes, I'm spooky. I'm a little ghosty goo. Ooh. Look at me haunting this place. With all of my anger and sadness. Okay. Oh, we got this guy. Nice. Oh, breaking the chains. Maybe he died at sea and this is how you cope? Oh, that could be too. I had not considered that. Okay. Um. We. Ah, oh, too high up. Unfortunate. Hey, remember that time we fought that big bird? Again, too high up. Okay, that was apparently not as high up now. Good. All right, we got about a minute and a half until we're going to take a break, so I'm going to try to climb this as quickly as possible. So that we can get to that break. Then I'm going to be logging off for the day, actually. So. Yep. Oh, he doesn't even shout. He just, like, blows wind. What is out here? Apparently my doom.
Okay. Well, um, I think that's where we're going to leave this game for today. Because uh, we only have about 30 seconds of it. Oh, hey, look at that. Aha! Just kidding. And also, I'm going to skip the end anyway, because I feel like we're at the end or very close to it. All right, we got five more minutes to finish this game. Gotta come over here, step on the ledge, drop down. Yeah, it is entirely possible, I guess, that he grew up to become the guy that died on the uh, on the sea. But it, at the very least, it answers the question of why he was like shrouded in shadows. Oh, when I do that, it makes the fire go out. Interesting. Okay, we got to be very careful here. Pull that down, break the chain. Hey, I'm back alive. I think. This room is very bright. I am very, very pale now. Oh, okay. That's a mighty big staircase. Okay. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to do one more ad break. I'm going to run it. And then we're going to finish this game. And then I'm going to log off for the night. Okay? Okay. So stay tuned. After this short ad break, we will be back with the conclusion, probably, of this game. Be right back. Okay, here we go. Doing the thing. Running the ad. Going to the beer at back screen. Where's the beer at back screen? There's the beer at back screen. Okay. Be back in. All right, we are back. Thank you very much for your patience, everybody. Hope you enjoyed the short break there. And now the thrilling conclusion, potentially, of this game. Hope you've enjoyed it so far. I certainly have. It has lived up to its uh, reputation as being, a, you know, cool and epic and sad in some parts, emotional at the very least. Wow, look at all those Naruto designs on the on the stairs. Down the steps, swan dive. Wah! Oh, I can't.
Wow, it's like I didn't have to do nothing at all. All right, let's see what's going on over here. Whoa. Whoa. Steep drop. Whoa. Hopefully we don't have to keep doing this. Our ankles won't hold up. Oh my goodness. So far away. But we're getting to the end, I feel like. Oh good, I don't have to make that jump. There's no hidden ledges here. What the heck? Oh no, I think I'm an old man now. So I guess you might have been right, Sly. It might have been that that character uh, died at sea. It sure looked that way. In which case, do we start all over now as the dad? Oh. We're going into a little hut. Interesting. I thought this was the end of the game. I mean, it still might be. Hmm. All right. I don't know what to make of this, but I can't roll and I can't shout. There's the guy I assume is my dad. Oh, okay. And now these little guys are just casting themselves into the abyss. Oh, I guess I have to do the same thing. Swan dive! Into the abyss we go. Aw. Wait, now I'm the old guy again. Hey, old guy, can you roll? Or jump or anything like that? No? Oh, okay. We're just kind of on rails now. Be going back into his kids room Oh, I get a little stuff fox plushy. Oh, it's not really a plushie, it's a little wooden thing. I think that was I think those are the toys we were trying to collect. Yeah, because we got the big bird. We got that guy. Oh, man. If I had known that, I would have got more of the... I would have done more searching. I just tried to, like, power through this game. What I should have been doing was looking for all the stuff. Yeah, those are the only ones we got. That's a bummer.
Beautiful view. I don't know what else to do in here now. What am I doing? Have I, like, not looked at everything? Do I need to do it in a certain order? Um... Kind of at a loss here. Have you tried to leave? I have not. I will do that now. Oh, he sees the ghost of his kid. Oh. Wow, okay. That was the end of the game. So it turned out the whole thing was about grief. Damn. It was sad, you're right. Sad that game was written by Rob Yescom. He used to come around the stream. Well, he came around one time anyway. Yeah, that was really... That was a pretty sad game, you're right. Very good, though. Lots of cool puzzles. I wish I had, like I said, spent more time looking for stuff. Just because then I could have, you know, had more of the toys for him to look at and stuff, but... I mean, when you look at how it played out, it... Yeah, it makes sense that it was about loss. I don't really have anything else to say. That was a great game. 
What did you guys think? It's really cool that they let them put in like a dedication for I feel like pretty much everybody on the team, but I'm not sure. You liked it? Good. I will say, I didn't expect to be able to finish this in just a couple of streams. Now, granted, they were both like longer streams than what I usually do, but I'm still kind of surprised I was able to finish it so quickly. It's a really good, like, short game. Well, short. I think it would have been like a standard, like, length game before we decided everything had to be like 100 hours, but yeah. All right. Well, I thought that credit sequence was going to go for a little bit longer, but I guess not. That was a really good game. No notes. Just really good. Did a great job of capturing the message it was trying to send. I think. I was going to say, are we really starting the credits over again? <laughs> yes, that was a very, very good game, though. I really enjoyed it. I'm glad that you guys enjoyed it as well. Um, that is going to do it for us today. So thank you, everybody, for stopping by. Sly, thank you for stopping by and talking to me throughout this game. Appreciate it very much. Um, more credits. No. No more credits. No more credits. Not right now. Um, I'm going to go and definitely not take a 90-second, you know, cry break. <laughs> And, uh, you know, go and do my uh, stuff that I got to do. So, uh, but again, thank you for joining uh, me and us and all of that. Um, hope to see you Wednesday. Yes, need to finish stretching and go back to my adulting. Indeed, indeed. Um, yeah. And uh, we'll see you next time. I will be back on Wednesday. Uh, theoretically. Assuming that I, uh, you know, I'm in the right headspace for it, I guess. Um, so definitely be here. We will probably be playing something else. Uh, most likely 
upper house. Yeah, possibly. We can go and do uh, some. We can finish off some more house stuff. We got time. Yeah. So, um, yeah, Wednesday we'll do house. And then Friday, I'm going to probably start a new game. I don't know which one yet. Um, I might even just do Dead by Daylight uh, for a little bit. And then Monday, next Monday, start a new game. Depending. I might I might start playing uh, Plague, uh, Plague Tale, uh, whatever that one's called there. Because I've been wanting to play it for a long time, and now that it's Halloween season, it just makes sense to me. But... Uh, either way, thank you everybody for stopping by today. I hope you all had a great time, and I will see you in the next one. Okay. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye. Bye.